Good morning. It is Jillian and Miss Rika, the Belgian Malinois. Hope you guys are all doing well. It is Friday morning at 8.30 in the morning. So we are in a clear space. We are not at a dog park. We're in a giant field with no one around. That is very rare for Los Angeles. We're trying to stay away from dog parks. Let's go. If you are new to our channel, what we're all about is training. So I'm not a trainer. My boyfriend Dave is not a trainer. We're just regular owners who put a lot of effort into our training. And I'd say the biggest things that we have to keep in mind and our recommendations for other regular owners who are just trying to train their own dog is to have patience, be consistent, and have some grit. It's freaking hard work. It all starts with basic obedience and gaining respect from your from your dog and also trust. Don't get frustrated at your dog because you will project that onto your dog and it won't be fun for your dog or for you. So yeah, you gotta have patience. transitioning away from doing the hand commands and we're really working on the book. It's a lot harder for her, but you know, she's always up for the challenge. The Malinois. Throughout the session is training. We'll play fetch, have Riker run around, and then I'll do foos, mite, sit, stand, um, all that stuff to continue to condition. Training's a lifestyle, and we are here for it. hyped up. So what I like to do with Rika is do a few laps around before we actually start training. It's a lot of fun for both of us. Let's hit it. So typically Malinois only have one main handler. Dave and I like to both train her. We have a lot of fun with it. So we have to make an effort to communicate what vocals we're using, what hand signals we're using, so that Rika understands the positions and doesn't get confused. After all, she's a dog. Yeah, she's smart, but she ain't that smart. If you're working on training your dog, I highly suggest filming it. I like sharing what we do, but I also go back and see what I'm doing wrong and what I'm not being consistent. Good to document the progress. There is nothing, nothing wrong with sharing on social media. It's a lot of fun. The community is awesome. It does get boring and your dog will get distracted if it's just hammering in the commands. Make it fun for you and the dog. Be consistent and be patient. The keys to successful training. If you guys like what we're doing, please go and subscribe, like, and comment, and check out our Instagram for more content of Malinois training slash life of a Malinois owner. Remember, I'm not a trainer. I'm just an owner. So if I can do this, you can do this. All right, adios, enough from me.